Like man, oh man, I'm back at y'all again with another one, man. Make sure if you new over here, you hit that like button and most definitely subscribe to the channel, man. Hey, man, say, man, that boy Hernandez Govan done got himself into some more trouble, man. And it all stemmed from the interview that he did on YouTube recently with the blogger from Memphis. I don't remember his name off the top of my head, but I also reviewed his uh, live, which was basically an interview of Hernandez Govan, man. And let me tell y'all, man, the courts was not happy with what your boy done did, man. That judge gave him a reading like your mama used to give you when you was in trouble. She told him he is not, I repeat, he is not to do not a damn nutter interview for nobody. Whether he talking about the case or not, she reminded him of how fortunate he was to be able to get a bond y'all and be out on bun they told him it, it made the court feel a certain type of way for him to feel like he's actually still free she told him you not really free you're on bun do everything you supposed to do and then come to find out he was supposed to be in court yesterday y'all he was supposed to be in court yesterday and he did not go. She said that uh, his lawyer told him that he was good to leave because he was getting a barrage of phone calls. She told him whenever his name is on her docket, he is to show up, whether his attorney uh, tells him not to uh, or not be there, you know what I'm saying, or we locking you up. Now they said uh, here in a couple of days or a couple of weeks, they're gonna go over his bond again. And if she comes to the decision that she wants to revoke it, well, guess what, bro? You out of there. Man, look, here go the footage right here. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe to the channel, man. What is going on? I don't have to tell you how serious these charges are. I don't have to know I don't even have to go back through that. Okay? Um, I also shouldn't have to remind you that you're out on a bond that and the court has put you under some real serious or some real tight stipulations. Yes, At this point, the court feels like you're playing and playing fast and loose with the court in these situations. And I don't like that. You have filed a motion through your attorney asking me to review your bond condition. And before we could ever do that, I get a message from a concerned citizen that you're out doing interviews. Whether you're talking about this case or not, you're doing interviews. And, and the court doesn't like the fact that you feel free enough to do interviews because what could be happening is that you could be in jail and it's a whole lot easier to supervise you there but you've been given the opportunity to post a bond with, with bond conditions and you're not doing those things you need to do We're going to review those bond conditions on March the 1st. But let me make myself extremely clear to you that you are to not have any interviews with anybody for any reason. Your attorney has assured me that nothing was said about this case in that interview. And I, I, I have no reason not to believe what he told me was true. But like I said, you should not be interviewing with anyone. You should not be making any public statement and you should be in the house. That means not going to anybody's funeral. Put your hand down and speaking through your attorney at this point. That means not going to funerals or anywhere else. That means in the house as of right now. And 
about you not showing up on yesterday or showing up and then leaving because your counsel thought it was appropriate to allow you to go home because you were getting a barrage of phone calls, that's neither here nor there. When you're supposed to be here, you're supposed to be here. Were you not on my docket yesterday? You were supposed to be here. Bottom line. I thought I would. He instructed me not to come. Like I said, you are supposed to be here. Whether your attorney is here or not, you should be here. Yes, ma'am. Do you understand that? Yes, ma'am. Do you understand what house arrest means as of this point? Yes, ma'am. I'll see you back here on March the 1st, sir. All right, thank you. Please don't give me any reason to, to revoke this bond. Right. And we won't even have to have this conversation. Yes, ma'am. March 1st.